I'm Dr. Julie Nielsen. I'm from the Dealey Research Center in Victoria on the west coast of Canada. Uh, I've been studying cancer and genetics uh, in school and then uh, when I finished school I wanted to work on a type of cancer therapy that was different from conventional chemotherapies. I wanted to try something totally different that might offer new promise. And so I went to a center where they study the immune response to cancer and trying to develop uh, T-cell based therapies where we can take the patient's own T-cells and we can genetically program them to recognize their uh, cancer cells. And it's a really exciting time to be in this field uh, because uh, there's a new appreciation now for how the immune system can actually be used to fight cancer. And there's all sorts of uh, breakthroughs happening right now and different types of immune-based therapies. And in addition, there's all sorts of breakthroughs in the technologies that are used to find mutations in cancer. And that helps us to understand how cancer develops and how it progresses. And it also gives us new things to target. Uh, so right now I'm combining immune-based immune therapies um, and all this information we're finding out about the genetics of cancer. And we're trying to develop uh, new therapies where we are programming these T cells to recognize mutations in Waldenstrom's. And uh, I got started in looking at Waldenstrom's uh, when I went to this new center where they were studying the immune response to cancer. And we had a Waldenstrom's patient who uh, was willing to provide money uh, to fund research into Waldenstrom's. So that's how I got started in looking at Waldenstrom's in particular. And it's just been a really uh, great time to be there with all the breakthroughs that have happened um, in, in mutations and whatnot. And, and so uh, I'm really excited about promise for the future of these therapies.